The thumbnail's not clickbait, boys. Patch notes are out, so... That's what it is. And, uh, I mean, it's kind of sad, to be honest, because... Well, I mean, not so sad with the Penance brand. Um, Penance brand was extremely OP, and a lot of people were using it. And I was tempted to do it, but I didn't want to. So, you know, yeah. For me, it doesn't matter that much that the Penance brand of Dissipation has been nerfed by quite, quite considerably. I'm sure it can still be brought to, you know, acceptable levels of bossing damage, but as it stands, it's going to be pretty, it's going to be pretty hard to scale properly now. And then if we scroll down a little more, there's one significant thing that I've seen. The tornado shot attack speed multiplier has been decreased, so you have slower attack speed. And then you also have the same animation as the puncture skill gem, which, if I'm not mistaken, is already like pretty long on its own. And it also increased the mana cost of it. And they also changed the uh, quality. Yeah, they, they just basically saw Tornado Shot and said, I see ya. I think it's a Grim nerf. <laughs> it's a Grim Row nerf. And from what I've been looking at, there hasn't been anything that's been too significant about melee, which is kind of sad. You know, like no melee damage increase, no bleed rework. You know, I mean, nothing that is too exciting legitimately. Although, for me, absolution of inspiring giving 250% of their value uh, with the increases and reductions to minion damage along with dominating blow of inspiring is also pretty interesting, which I think will make me want to try and go guardian again because, you know, it's more durable. I'm lazy in making glass cannon builds. I don't like glass cannon builds. For me, at least, that's the most significant changes as well. But, you know, look at the extended... Look at the... Uh, uh. There hasn't been anything about the gladiator as well. That's also really one thing that grinds my gears. It's like, that's the only thing we get for ascendancy changes. That's it. Come on. Guard just a guardian nerf. And then, you know, necromancer rework. I mean, it's... Eh. But still, you know, I don't want to play necromancer. It's not going to make me play necromancer even with changes like this. You know. <sighs> and sure, you can say that my opinion isn't what matters. No problem with that, but... <sighs> It just doesn't look so interesting, boys. And even the Necropolis League mechanic is kind of... I mean, sure you can do the bombastic crafting where you have so much, so many factors involved in adding them. But, you know, another crafting method. GGG. Full patch notes are going to be uh, in the pinned comment, guys. So please have a look at that. And uh, yeah, let me, know what, let me know what your thoughts are about these patch notes because they're kind of anticlimactic and they, they make the league look kind of boring. I'm not even going to play during the league start, so I don't even know if I'm going to continue playing or if I'm just going to go with my hardcore character last epoch. I don't know. One of them seems more interesting. It doesn't seem like it's the league.